those of you who were planning to first take care of their JE main exam and then target JE advance, now is the time for you. See this, 1735 to 28, that's a huge improvement. Are we going to cover this entire thing? The primary focus should be on test series. Hey dear students, I believe you are done with your JE main exams now. If not, you will be done very, very soon. So dear students, now that JE main exam is done, the obvious next question is what to do next or what to target next, all right? So I believe that this is the right time when you would start thinking about your J advanced preparation. Like I wouldn't say that this would be the right time, but it cannot be later than this. Those of you who have started earlier, you have done exceptionally well. But those of you who were planning to first take care of their J main exam and then target J advanced, now is the time for you. So what you need to do, let's ask yourself. Okay. So <clears throat> the next step should be uh, to ensure that you crack the J advanced because it is your gateway to IITs. And what is the best way to do that? I'm pretty sure that you guys already know the answer. The best way to crack JE Advance is to ensure that you are a participant in the Iklave program, in the Vedantu Iklave program, which is a dedicated program for JE Advance preparation. It is a program specially designed to take the students from JE mains level to JE Advance level. And it is not that this is something new. We have been doing this for past several years now. And to show you that what success this program has achieved, uh, <clears throat> Let me show you the results that we have been able to get. So in 2021, you can see that Prerak got a JE main rank of 243 and he ended up getting AIA 35 in JE advance. Okay, that's a huge improvement. Kevin got a JE main rank of 533 and he got to 78, AIR 78 in JE advance. Abhinav got a rank of 512 in JE main and he ended up getting a rank of uh, 156 in the JE uh, advance examination. All right, and there are many other such stories you can see. And this is 2021. Now you would say that sir, 2021 is as long back in past. Okay, then we have more results also, more recent results also. That's 2022. Divyanshu went from 149 to AIR 11. Chaitanya went from 172 to 47. Harsh went from 336 to 48. And so many other examples are there. 2022 is still distant past, sir. Okay, let's have a look at 2023 then. 59 to 21. See this, 1735 to 28. That's a huge improvement. Aditi went from 489 to 104. Parth went from 236 to 113. And the most recent one, the latest one, the last year edition, uh, Pranav, he went from, he scored exceptionally well ranked in JE main. He go, ended up getting AIR 101 in um, uh, the JE advanced examination. Uma went from 188 to 266. Then Harashi Sharada went from 726 to 476 and so on. You can see that uh, what are the great improvement stories. Palak went from 755 to 7. Uh, 94. So guys, obviously, uh, there is something systematic and there is something uh, in this program which is helping the students perform above their potential. So what exactly is that? So I'll try to share the secret with you guys. And the secret is that uh, we have a two-pronged strategy, you know, the right two-pronged strategy. And what are those two prong prongs that help the student in improving upon uh, their current potential? So guys, uh, one is uh, you know, discovery and elimination of your weak areas. Let's understand this, that you have written the JE main examination. It means that you have already covered the entire syllabus. If not the complete syllabus, you have covered majority portion of the syllabus. And in your coverage, there are little chinks in your armor. So there are areas where you are not very comfortable, where which you don't know that they even exist. You know, there are some concepts that you might not have been exposed to. Okay, so there are few things in every chapter or in most of the chapters that you have either not seen yet or if you have seen them, but you are not very well versed with them and therefore you struggle in questions when, when those concepts or those ideas are used. Okay, so we need to identify, we need to discover them. You know, the worst part about these ideas is that you don't even know that they exist or that you don't even know that you are weak in those areas. All right, because uh, you're not even aware of how to use them. Okay, so the first part is to discover those ideas and then to eliminate. So that is your first step or the first target that we try to achieve in this program. Discovery and elimination of weak areas. And the second part is that let's say once we have discovered all your weak areas and we have made you stronger in those, in those weak areas, then the next part is to ensure that you are able to convert your knowledge into marks. All right. And how do we achieve that? We achieve that by our Iklave advanced test series. So that's a famous test series. Again, uh, many of the previous year students, all the names that I just showed you, they've participated in the, those test series. Many have vouched for the test series, stating that this is one of the best test series. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. This is not one of the best. This is the best test series available for JE Advanced in India. You know, and the, these students were enrolled. They have tried tests of many other uh, national level institutes also. And after that comparison, they have said that the test series that uh, Vedantu possesses, that kind of test series is nowhere in any other institute. So the two prongs, all right, the right two prongs are uh, you know, the famous uh, Iklava Rank Accelerator Material or the ERAM, the Iklava Rank Accelerator Module. Okay, uh, what is this exactly? So, uh, in this, you know, uh, I'll, I'll elaborate on this um, uh, in a moment. So, the, the first part is this booklet and the second part is the test series. Okay, so if I try to tell you about the booklet, so these are three books that we have prepared. We call them as the Rank Accelerator Modules. Okay, uh, in every subject, physics, chemistry, maths, in every subject, 
the entire j e advanced syllabus has been divided into 10 parts 10 parts in physics 10 in chemistry 10 in mathematics and every part in uh, you know in, in every book is called a unit so physics has been divided into 10 units chemistry into 10 units mathematics into 10 units each unit contains two to three chapters multiple chapters that is so there are about 10 units each unit containing about uh, two or three chapters okay and then each chapter is divided into part a and part b okay Total, this booklet would have would have about 900 to 1000 question, same number of questions or similar number of questions will be there in chemistry, similar number of questions will be there in mathematics. Now, the idea is that when you solve these 1000, 1000, 1000 approximately questions in each subject, okay, uh, all these questions, they are handpicked by, a, you know, extremely experienced teachers, very, very experienced teachers, they have handpicked these questions. So, they have made this collection of questions, uh, trying to ensure that this collection covers each and every concept that is there to be covered in a chapter and not only the coverage of concept but also the coverage of variety of application like if a, there is a concept let's say constraint motion you know how to use constraint motion in a in a uh, you know two thread problem that's the concept now the varieties that exist that uses this concept so we have tried to make use of all those questions you know all those varieties have been covered here so when you solve every question from these modules okay you at least you become very very sure that there is no concept left untouched now all right, so the first part is this. We've been doing this since the month of February, like after the J main one attempt. Uh, the students who were already part of Eclavet, they started solving these content. They are midway, uh, you know, solving this content and it's continuing. And we will be able to finish this thing by April 20, somewhere around April 20, April 21, 22. And then our, uh, you know, the, the famous test series will begin. So this test series is also, again, it's going on right now. Okay, so it consists of part tests as well as full tests. Part tests happen while the rank accelerator module is in progress. So while the students are solving this, uh, after every two unit, we conduct a part test. That part test contains the syllabus of the previous two units. So right now, the part tests are going on. The part test will be done by the time we cover the rank accelerator module. That is around April 20, April 21. And then the full syllabus test will begin. All right, total five part tests are going to be there as there are 10 units. And uh, after every couple of units, we take a part test. So there are going to be five part tests. Uh, some of them have already happened. One or two are yet to happen. And then we, are, we will begin with the full test. Okay, and there would be around 10 to uh, 13 full tests that we will be conducting. Out of these full tests, some will be the rank predictor test. Now, what are rank predictor tests exactly? So, guys, there are certain test papers which we have not modified for the past two to three years, except for some errors that we, you know, that students have highlighted. So, we have not modified these papers. And all the all your seniors, all the previous year student and the year previous to that, all those students who have written these tests, we have their marks with us. We also have their J advanced rank, you know, the actual J advanced rank with us. So when you write these tests and you score in a certain range, we are able to see that the students who scored in this range, they got so and so J advanced rank. So where will you stand? Like so, so that would be a good indicator of how much rank can you get in the J advanced examination. So these are rank predictor tests, and we have other kind of tests also. You know, some theme based tests which will really test your application, which will test your decision making uh, while the exam goes on. So we have some theme based tests. Students absolutely love them. I'm very sure that you are also going to love them. So uh, these are the two prongs that ensure that students who are following this program do exceptionally well. Now, there is something that is very important to understand that how will Eclave look like after the J main second attempt? So, are we going to cover this entire thing? Uh, so, guys, it's something, you know, covering uh, the entire rank accelerator module. It requires time, you know, because you have to attempt about 3000 questions. You need time for that. So, uh, let me put it very bluntly that we are past that time. We are past the time. So, some units are left. We are really we'll solving them. All the students who join this program now, they will get access to all the previous sessions that have happened in the batch. They will get access to the content also, like the hard copies of the material will be ship, uh, shipped to them. So you will get the booklets. You can choose certain chapters where you feel you need more solving and you can start solving those chapters. Uh, don't expect to cover the entire booklets now because uh, now it would be too late. Like we have around 40, 45 days uh, before you write the J advanced examination. And uh, towards the end, we must focus on the test series rather than keep on solving the content. You can solve the content, but the primary focus should be on test series. So you will get the rank accelerator module. You can choose the chapters in which you particularly feel weak and you can target those chapters. But apart from that, the primary focus should now be on the test. The upcoming units which are left, you can actually focus on those and then you can shift your focus to the um, uh, full syllabus test. And that's why what we have done now, earlier there were scholarships that we were awarding on the basis of percentile. Now we have removed all that and we have slashed the price to a great extent. You know, earlier, the uh, the uh, price for this batch was 20,000. Now we are selling it at, at a flat uh, rate of 5,000. All right. Let's just say that what you get in 5,000, if I put it, uh, if I try to uh, see how much value do I get, 
this 5000 contains uh, all the hard copies of the rank x soldier module that's about uh, you know 2000 rupees um, if you try to buy it separately that's around 1500 rupees so you get that and apart from that you get the j advanced test series also so if you try to buy any j advanced test series you know from any any institute you anyways pay about 6 to 7000 rupees all right so in 5000 rupees you are getting the module also you are getting the test series also and most importantly you are getting to compete with the real j advanced aspirants you know the eclubs students and you're going to face a very stiff competition from them all right now how to enroll just scan this QR code and it will take you to the page where you can pay the fees and join the batch. And if this QR code somehow, let's say if it is not working, you will find the link in the description of this session also. You can click on the link and you can join the uh, batch. If you want to only purchase the Rank Accelerator module, the link of that also has been put in the description of this session. You can buy it from there. All right, students, hope to see you. Hope to see many of you in the batch and then on the other side of the IIT gate. Take care, students. Bye-bye.